Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Today on Enjoy, we'll be talking about smart AI and the other updates going on around AI. So we're all prepared for early access. And can your PC run this smart AI? Let's break it down. So recently, some more news came out regarding the smart AI feature. Maybe about a couple of days ago, this kind of went under um, everyone's nose. So kind of what the news is basically is that we're doing a little bit more of a slightly detailed breakdown. And they gave a quick overview on the site on kind of what to expect from the um, smart Zoe. And I thought it was important just to make sure we went over it again because it does have some keys that I think some people may have forgotten. So for instance, the smart Zoe AI feature will probably be the most intriguing feature of the game to see exactly how it gets used and then how it gets um, done in the game. We'll be very curious to watch. I know for me, I'll be um, looking for that, especially um, we've, we've already seen the video of it, of kind of how it goes, what the raw gameplay of it is. However, what we haven't seen and I think it's gonna be very curious. And I think this maybe got lost during the smart um, Zoe stuff that we all were talking about was this. At the end of each day, the smart Zoys will adjust their personal schedule of activities based on their experiences, further enhancing gameplay. So let's hear that again. At the end of each day, Smart Zoys will adjust their personal schedule of activities based on their experiences. So that means the people you encounter, the things that you decide to do the day before now carries over. Every decision that you make now carries weight. When you have on this feature. So every decision now carries weight. Like for those who love those um, story driven AAA RPG, then this is really what you want. This is something that you would really like. I do think this has a lot of positives for you because every single interaction now will matter. And that's something, and that's something that I think was not there before as far as in detail, because remember, this smart Zoe feature was not always there. This feature was not always there. That's a big key. Remember that this was almost put in. I wouldn't say on the last end of the run for the dev team, but I would say pretty close. So I'm very curious to see how this all interacts. I'm curious what the cutscene will look like and how will they tell you things have changed and all those little things it's really important that you understand that each choice you make throughout the day throughout the night will matter into your next day because with the smart joy feature on it will adjust your personal schedule to activities that you've done with your experiences so it's really giving you a unique play style if you ask me in its own way if you really think about it enzoi is giving you two games in one if you think about it they're giving you the smart zoi feature which basically turns the game into this almost auto thinking tool that then learns from you as you play and then it's going to dictate around that in each day going forward and then if you turn off the the um smart zoe feature you then now have a totally different game where yes your choices still matter but they don't matter in the same way as with the smart zoe feature on it doesn't carry as much weight on a um, day to day basis. So I think it's very, very important that you always take a look at that and try to see 
what play style that day you want to do. Remember, with the Smart Zoy feature and the Free Will feature on, you really will be given the character that you don't control super like free range as far as what they want to do, what they kind of become. So I do think that is something that you should really take thought in when you're going into play that day, what kind of style you want to use and go from there. On to some more news here as well that involves the Smart Zoy feature. And I think it's very cool. And if you remember a couple of days ago, or maybe it's been a week now a bit i put out a video that showed basically they were playing in zoi at a conference and they did the ai input if you remember and you saw how that influenced the um your zoi so i think that is kind of what this is um alluding to when it says players will also be able to observe their smart zoys and her thoughts in real time as they go about their day and influence them directly with a free form text input to modify their actions and life goals you see now we saw that in the video gameplay already if you remember i'm gonna um maybe try to get a picture popped up here in a moment so um you can see what i'm talking about but yeah like if you remember they had that they would put the input in and then these zoi would go about their day doing what they said they were going to do so now that you have this now in writing it just makes more sense what we saw now in that conference video and it's cool because it's going to, again, it makes, you can really increase what's happening and change what's happening in a blink with that input. It's a very powerful tool, a very smart tool to give us. I'm glad they thought about it. It makes a lot of sense to do it. And um, it's really good. Like, I'm just glad that we have that and we have this option and it's important that everyone use this option so it's important you buy the game the right way so you can um, use GeForce if you need to um, because you know you don't want to lose out on these small features like this so this here is really really cool to further break down everything um, Enzoi will launch into as you know early access around that time now gamers with a GeForce RTX GPUs can enable Smart Zoy. So again, that's why I think I would just say if you're on the fence, if you're on the fence and you have a GTX, all good. This feature you cannot use. That that's reality. If you have a GTX, you cannot use this feature. If you want to launch your computer natively, if you're willing just for the sake of experience which let me, let me like let me say this right we spend money on a lot of things just for the experience so don't tell me that you can't spend 999 if you have a gaming pc right now you can leverage nine or ten dollars whenever you have it i am saying right now whenever you have it because i've been there whenever you have it okay and you get a chance to enjoy this for a couple hours and get the full experience. I'm not saying you gotta always use, to use it, but to have this feature in a game that you have and not use it because of your graphic card, when you know there are a couple um, alternatives like GeForce or you can um, get your own virtual desktop at Air, GPU, that's A-I-R, gpu.com you know so there's ways to enjoy it and i hope everyone takes advantage of that and does not waste opportunity to play the game of the year in my opinion if you think about what the game is going to allow you to do mix with how it looks mix with the updates coming with brand new cities uh like um western cities um 
European cities as well. So, you know, it's, it's a lot of things that are being made for this game. Um, weddings and other things. So, really looking forward to see what they're coming up with. That's for sure. But it looks like the smart Zoy feature will be one of the biggest selling draws for this game and i'm very curious to get my hands on it and see how it works and see what happens i want to say thank you for watching and listening please like the video and subscribe to the channel i will see you on the next one take care